Today, Kevin and I are going to be trying some Fundalina. These are all chocolate hazelnut spreads, but they're different flavors with the chocolate hazelnut. So we have vanilla, strawberry, banana. These were $3.29 each at Jungle Gems International Market. They had one other flavor. I think it was just chocolate and hazelnut without any other flavor added in. It's like, I don't need to get that. Uh, but these are a product of Greece. Uh, so no preservatives, no artificial colors or flavors, no hydrogenated oils. This is a 13 ounce jar for $3.29. That's pretty good. Uh, two tablespoons are 200 calories. Not a low calorie snack. <laughs> no. Well, it's about like peanut butter, you know? Right. Peanut butter, uh, regular peanut butter is about that same thing. Okay. Mm -hmm. So, you go first. I'm gonna get a little bit of both. Oh, yeah, we too. So, we literally, uh, they've divided the jar. It's, a, it's runnier than I was expecting. I like the flavor. I got a clean spoon, by the way. I like the, yeah, we have different spoons. <laughs> Yeah, the vanilla part's just a little bit runnier than the chocolate hazelnut part. Mm -hmm. But they go really good together. They the, do go very well. The vanilla together. almost overpowers the hazelnut. Um, I think it's delicious. It's very good. This would be... Can you imagine um, that spreading on a piece of toast? That's exactly what I was thinking. This would be great on a piece of toast. Ritz cracker. Uh, Ritz cracker would be great with this. <laughs> Um, I mean, honestly, what's not good on a Ritz, but even, this even, would even be even better. Yes, I think this, it, it would be, um, yeah, it would be great on a lot. You could put it in oatmeal if you wanted oh, wow, to. that smells good. It does smell really good. The strawberry smells very strong. Mm -hmm. It is also two tablespoons, is 200 calories, so... Uh, Hazelnut what did, and strawberry. What do you think about the hazelnut in there? I didn't really. I, I didn't got. I, see, I got a lot of the hazelnut. I got some, but not a lot. You know? It reminded me of uh, Nutella. I love the texture. It's almost frosting like. Mm hmm. I think you could frost a cupcake with that. You probably could. Yeah. Because it's a very soft texture. Mm hmm. That, what do you not think quite about sticky that? either. I like the strawberry. I want just some of the hazelnut because I really haven't gotten a lot of the hazelnut. The flavor. strawberry flavor to me, um, it doesn't come across as sweet as um, a strawberry cake frosting. It's not that sweet. No, but it's it's pretty sweet. It is sweet, but it's I not agree, it's like not as sugary sweet as that. No, you're. I'm comparing this to like just your traditional American. Uh, oh, strawberry sure. cake frosting, and it doesn't no, have the sweetness. It's not. But you could, you could literally scoop that up, and spread it on a cupcake. You absolutely could. So It'd what? Be you, expensive. But what did you think of the strawberry? It's good. I like the strawberry. It's not a natural strawberry though. It is more of a um, not a candy like an artificial strawberry, but it's not like chemical like. No, strawberry. it doesn't taste chemical like at all. But it doesn't taste like a fresh one either. Oh, gosh, that smells good. That smells like runts, like banana. Uh-huh. This is also uh, 200 calories. Go ahead. I tried some so the, of... It's banana. I tried some of just the hazelnut spread, though. Mm -hmm. I, I still don't get a ton of hazelnut. It's I'll like try some hazelnut by itself. It's like that's not the main point of these. <laughs> well, I think I got three-fourths banana. banana. Yeah, because the hazelnut's way down here. Now, that's a little like thicker and stickier, but it's really good fake banana flavor. Yeah, I really like that. The yeah, it's not just the hazelnut, because I, I mean it's there, but it's not, it's easily overwhelmed by the flavoring, let's put it that way. It's just not that strong. It's not as strong as a Nutella, mm -hmm. but I like it. It's very good. And I like how really thick and creamy it is. Um, yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't, I actually like this quite a bit. Mm -hmm. I like the combination because you do get a little bit of that chocolate hit through there. Mm -hmm. I really, my favorite thing now. We used up all of the spoons I brought us, so we can't, That's okay. eat, anymore. can't eat anymore. Um, 
I really like all of them. Honestly, all of them would go really good with whatever you wanted to put them on. Yes. Um, but my favorite's a banana. Um, I like a good fake candy banana, though. Yeah, I'm going to say my favorite's the banana. My least favorite's the strawberry. Probably. Just because it's, I would want it to be a much, much sweeter. Even though it is plenty sweet enough, I want sweeter. So I'm going to go banana and then vanilla mm -hmm. and then strawberry. I, I would agree with that. Not necessarily because the strawberry is bad in any way, shape, or form. It's just not quite as good as the vanilla banana. Mm -hmm. So we found these, these at Jungle Gems International Market, like I said. Uh, they sell a lot of foreign food. So like I said, these are from Greeks. I'm wondering if any of you all have seen these like in the international aisle of your grocery store. Um, I was going to look up something. Oh, do you have to refrigerate them? Store in a cool, odor-free place out of direct sunlight. So, I guess so. Odor-free. I guess because they'll absorb odors really. So. But it does not say that you need to keep them in no, the refrigerator. No, so you just put the lid on and put in the cabinet. You just can like put it in the cabinet. Butter. Yes. So, you'll have to let us know if you see these in, in your uh, grocery store uh, because you might have an international grocery aisle mm -hmm. and you might see them. They're very, very good. Yes, very good, well worth buying. So, I hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching.